this one is one that I uh, uh, I loved it when I got it, and uh, since then the pie plate has turned into a little bit of a more rattly thing than I wanted. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, it's got a great wood sound to it, and that's why I love this one because the other one. Uh, that I have is more metal sounding, even though it's not a metal resonator. Mm -hmm. It's uh, this one's real woody. Forgot the slide. names and thought to myself this is a nice sounding guitar but it just doesn't have a good feel to me mm -hmm. um, you know whether it's stuff like the width of the neck and the, the depth of the neck I have no idea this one is just as feels good in my hand felt good in my hand at the store still feels good today I sit on on the driveway with this one and, and it's just one, like this is for like the front and the back porch guitar absolutely and it's got a it's got a plug in as you can see this stuff I've never plugged this one in I think it's the idea of du a dual miking. Right. You know, I would mic. I would think you would mic this in a in a smaller room, and then run the run a long line to mm -hmm. a separate room and and punch up whatever you're getting acoustically, or maybe vice versa, punch up whatever you're getting electrically, um, with just a little bit of feed off the mic uh, in the studio. What you're getting on the acoustic in the sound. <laughs> 